You son of a bitch! What's the matter? Push it through pencils? That's my terrible Arnold impression. That's Tiny Todd. Goodbye, Tiny Todd. It's bizarre, isn't it? You know, I created Tiny Todd, the character of the demonic soul that escaped from hell, who haunts my nightmares and hides out my, my vents at night and tries to kill me when I'm sleeping. But I invented that a couple years ago and people still remember it. It's weird, it's bizarre, and Tiny Todd will get the resurrection he deserves one day. Dylan, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, especially by the intro, this is my Predator spoof t-shirt, Pencil Pushers Gym. This is probably one of the coolest shirts I own right now. I wore it today to the gym. It's a little bit sweaty and smells like, uh, I don't know, it smells like an old man who's profusely sweating and he's wearing a little too much aftershave, but I kind of like it. So if you guys want a closer look at this t-shirt, you can click the link down below to redbubble.com. This isn't my design, this is somebody else's design, but it's really cool, I had to pick it up. I love it. I mean, look at that. Look at these two guys' biceps right there. Look at that. What's the matter, pushy too many pencils? Woo! Okay, I gotta calm down. I had two scoops of my pre-workout energy drink today because one wasn't gonna cut it. It was like, do I want to take a scoop of this, lick a battery, and take another scoop, or just call it two scoops? I needed a little bit. I, I wanted to be wired. When I went to the gym, I just wanted to be profusely sweating, walking back and forth, and I just hit myself in the head and scream, and then they call the cops. I get arrested. Okay, so let's calm down. Uh, here's my question to you. How are you guys doing? You guys doing good? Everybody okay? Uh, let me know down below how you're doing because it's not about me, it's about us. It's about us against the system. It's about showing that the human spirit is still alive while everyone else is inching down the freeway in their metal coffins. And that's why I robbed banks. That's how I, uh, I wanted to show you guys something. Okay, this is the part of the video where we get serious. And you're probably asking yourself, John, why are you standing so close to me? Because we're getting serious right now and I want to show you guys a $547 paperweight. That's right. This right here is my old phone. It's an HTC One. Very nice phone. I really enjoyed it. And here's what happened. Here's the story of why this phone just doesn't want to function anymore. Yesterday, I was doing my laundry like a responsible adult. I just, be, to be honest with you, I kind of just learned how to do my laundry and I was like 24 years old. Don't, um, and uh, I don't, like the whole concept of laundry is confusing. You go to the washing machine, it has all these different settings on it. You're like, do I mix this with this? What the hell is the bleach for? Do I use this? I don't know. And then what I do is I just stuff everything in that son of a bitch, push wash. I don't care what happens. It's going to come out clean. That's all that matters. So in my sad attempt to do my own laundry, uh, what happened was I was wearing a pair of pants at the time. I was like, you know what? I'm I'm gonna be productive. I'm taking these sons of bitches off, putting them in the washing machine. I'm gonna wash everything. Yeah, I don't want a pair of dirty pants laying around. Uh, so my phone was in my pocket in my quick attempt to wash all of my clothes, and it got a nice spin cycle, sit in the water for about 30 minutes, and then I was sitting there on the couch watching uh, Modern Marvels, where they're talking about steam-powered engines. That's the kind of weird stuff I do at three o'clock in the morning, and I realized, oh no. Please don't be in there. I go down to the washing machine, I put my hand in that dark, cold abyss, I pull this out, and I scream to the heavens, No! And since this is broken and it doesn't matter anymore, I'm just gonna drop it right there on the floor. There you go. I never thought I'd do that to a $500 phone, but that's, it just made me feel a little bit better about myself. I don't know why. You're going down, Bodie. It's a soundtrack from Point Break. I don't know why, just an amazing soundtrack score. Uh, and it's got like this symphonic, electric, uh, symphony kind of sound, but very epic, very relaxing. Uh, it's definitely one of the uh, kind of overlooked uh, scores for movies, in my opinion. So uh, I think you guys should go to YouTube and check that out. It's very relaxing. Like, it's a little bit epic, a little bit relaxing. You're like, I don't know if I want to go rob banks, go skydiving, or meet a quarterback undercover FBI agent named Johnny Utah. I'll take all three. And by the way, speaking of t-shirts, if you guys want to win a free t-shirt or at least $25 towards redbubble.com to buy whatever you want, you can buy one of my t-shirts, somebody else's t-shirt, it doesn't matter. Uh, you guys can join me tomorrow night on Flick It live or flicking live I have to come up with an exact title but anyway I'll do a live Google hangout tomorrow night I'll announce it a few hours ahead of time on Facebook and Twitter uh, but here's all you got to do if you guys want a free chance to win follow me on Twitter link down below and tweet I want to flick pick t-shirt and give me any reason why right after that and what I'm going going to do is randomly pick one of those tweets and I'll give you the code for $25 free by whatever you want uh, I always wanted to be a drill sergeant. I just, something about the authority, like, you know what I mean? You, you just take your anger out on 
Yeah, anyway, uh, I kind of want to wear this from now on. I don't. Could you guys watch a video if I just wore this hat all the time and screamed at you? I don't know. I don't think, uh, I don't think it's healthy. I'm going to put that over there and save it for later after I drink my chocolate milk. Uh, so anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, that was just some random topics. But make sure you join me tomorrow night. We're going to aim towards... Let's aim towards like a 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time zone uh, for a live flick everything or flicking live. I don't know what I'm going to call it yet. Uh, so I'll do a live uh, giveaway and we'll talk about some movies, some other fun stuff. Thanks for watching, guys. Let me know your thoughts, your opinions down below. I'll see you guys next time.